What's up everybody? It's TD Bricks here with another tutorial. And in today's video I will be teaching you how to make this very simple Roth iron fence. A really nice color variation and let's get right into the tutorial. So to make the fence you are going to need these following parts. You're going to need this 1x1 comb brick. You're going to need a bunch of these 1x2 bricks. You're also going to need a bunch of these 1x2 jumper plates and a couple of these 2x2 two two jumper plates and you're going to need uh, a bunch of these antenna pieces and those are pretty much all the parts. I don't really have a specific number that I would recommend you using. It really depends on how big you're making your fence. So let's get started. So as we can see here we have this very simple um, 4x12 base plate that I've laid out and what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a bunch of these 1x2 wine red bricks and I'm just going to lay them and create a line in the very center of this 4x12 base plate. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab 8 of these 1x2 jumper plates here. I'm going to place them on top of my bricks and I'm going to place them in the very center as well and make sure when you place them you place them like this Make sure that you don't place them like that because it's not going to work. So there we go. We can all see what I did. I have two spots on the sides where I left some room. Pretty straightforward. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get um, the rest of my wine red pieces. I'm going to get 20 more and I'm going to make um, two different columns. So each column will have about 10 of these. So there we go. We have our two columns that consist of a total of 20 one by 2 um, wine red bricks. So the next thing I'm going to do to make the actual fence is I'm going to get eight of these antenna pieces. I'm just going to place them on top of my jumper plates. There we go. We can all see that the antenna pieces are placed on top of the jumper plates. Very simple. So the next thing I'm going to do, just to add extra detail on my two columns of brick, is I'm going to get two of my 2x2 two two jumper plates, and I'm also going to get two of these comb bricks. I'm going to place my comb bricks on top of my jumpers, and then I'm going to place these little two little guys here. I want to place them on top of each column. And now our fence looks really super nice with a lot of detail and beautiful color variation. So that was the tutorial. I hope this video was useful for you guys. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I would appreciate the support. If you have any questions or ideas, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. And thank you so much for watching.